As of today, over 1,000 cases across 65 counties have been confirmed with hepatitis A. The health department says on a normal year, there's usually about 20 cases. Jacqueline Nye has a story. 65 counties, 1,094 cases, and the numbers aren't stopping. On a normal year, there are only about 20 cases of hepatitis A in all of Kentucky. And the Lexington Fayette County Health Department says they aren't sure exactly why there has been a rise in Hep A. Typically, it's spread through what's called oral fecal contamination. So essentially, somebody goes to the bathroom, they don't wash their hands properly, and then they contaminate food. The health department says near Lexington, Montgomery County is the area that has the most cases of hepatitis A. Although Lexington has only had a handful of cases, the health department says they're preparing for it to hit the area. Giving vaccinations to the at-risk groups, working in the jails, homeless centers, people in our needle exchange program, those are going to be really at high risk. And we've also been working with restaurants. The state has even taken precautions. Every student from kindergarten through high school is now required to have the Hep A vaccination when they start school this fall. It's a two-dose vaccination, so you can start school with just the first dose because the second isn't due until six months later. Covering the news in Lexington, Jacqueline Nye, LEX 18 News. Well, according to the health department, one of the bad things about Hep A, the side effects are so similar to the flu, you'll be tired and have headaches. But the biggest difference is jaundicing or yellowing of your skin.